Okay, here is a quick Q&A about Triple SR. You know, um, previously I showed you guys how to use like a Triple SR to get a specific image and um, process that image and then generate a OBJ or GLB output. So, uh, but there will be some problem um, if you do not like familiar with the workflow. So right now I am like, at the hogging phase, like an official uh, stability AI's Triple SR like demo page and as you guys can see I got like an input like a house like a really tiny demo of the house we got process image uh, basically just a removed background something like that and then I created like the object model well, it's sort of like a rendered model where you can you know um, you know walk, like uh, rotate this it's a really nice thing and then you can download that. Uh, I choose OBJ file download, and then I uh, open the Blender using like an import, okay, file import, and then you can import this uh, waveform dot OBJ file. But when you import this, you will find that uh, it just don't get any texture, okay. So uh, even though you say uh, you click this, you go to the shading, you try to add this, it won't do. Okay, uh, of course you, you can uh, you know, change it to a different thing, but uh, you know that's not what you want. So uh, the point of doing this, in fact, is not only get the mesh, but also get uh, like a uh, auto uh, texture uh, connected to it. Okay, so how to do that? How to do that? Pretty simple. The only thing that you need to do is to add because you know the output is a. Uh, the output OBJ have a vertex color info. It's not a bitmap uh, texture. So technically, it's not a uh, it's not a texture. So what I'm going to do is to just go to the shading, okay? And uh, we got like a material output and principal BSDF. Uh, instead of just doing this color, I'm going to shift and A and search for a color attribute. So do 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 color attribute, okay? Just the input of color attribute. And then I'm going to plug the color into the base color here, and voila, we got our texture automatically plugged in, and it looks pretty good. Okay, and then I can just go to layout and just the lighting, and uh, maybe just uh, got a word, background, lighting, something like that, and then I can rotate this, and uh, yeah, and of course you can render this. F12, I render this, and uh, yeah, that's uh, of course you can let, you know set the camera, do all sort of uh, like a scene settings, and uh, maybe use this as a kind of a like a like a reference for your storyboard something like that. Okay, so um, yeah, really simple. Hope this video is helpful. If it is helpful, please give me a thumb up and subscribe to my channel. All right.